Hey, what's up friends? Welcome to our November 2015 video blog. Thanks so much for checking this out. Uh, we know that we totally missed last month's video blog. Uh, and that's because, well, we're home. Woohoo! Yeah! Uh, and totally like deep into that. And there was just, there was, we were flying and all sorts of stuff. And I was just like, dang it. Oh well. <laughs> and so we skipped it. Uh, yeah, so this one counts for both October and November. Doubly cool. Uh, yeah, so we're home and it's winter again and that's cool. Um, we like winter, <laughs> but yeah, uh, now we have a cozy fire to sit by, so that's mm -hmm. lovely. Um, but yeah, let, I want to give you an update on what the last couple of months has been like, uh, and then share kind of like, yeah, just where we're at. So in September, we talked about how we were going to go to Kona and, uh, we did, we went to the tribe conference. Uh, which was a gathering of various people from all over the world. Uh, it was probably about like 30 some odd people. They came together to discuss uh, lifestyle missions and uh, missional community and, and what that looked like for this branch of YWAM. Uh, to, to hear some stories of uh, what people are doing around the world and how the Lord is leading people within the conference. So it was really cool. Uh, everyone kind of got to share the story. We got to share a story about the tent makers which was super refreshing. People were so behind us and like, that's super sick. Um, and yeah, it's, it's just exciting to see what the Lord is trying to do and plant in YWAM through the tribe. So if you'd like to check them out, you can actually go to their website, YWAM tribe. So Y-W-A-M-T-R-I-B-E.com. Link is in the doobly-doo, check that out. Um, or you can also go to We Are The Tribe on Instagram. Uh, and check them out there and see kind of what they're all about and you'll see photos of us and that kind of thing. So anyways, that was a blast. And yeah, we love those dudes. They're super cool. Mm -hmm. Super excited to potentially do some other mischief with them in the future. We're just kind of figuring out how that looks and how that works with our community back here at home, so. Yeah. yeah, yeah. speaking of community back home, it's been so awesome to be back mm -hmm. and reconnect with everybody, with Worship sure. in the Word, with The Crux, the group we do Thursdays, and, and just family and friends. It's such totally. a, a joy to uh, reunite and just be with those that you really do love and care for. So we're so grateful for this last month and the time that we've had to reconnect and. Uh, meet up with people. Uh, it's been a joy, even though it's been a little crazy and uh, it's been a little strange returning home as it always is, but yeah. it's been really good and uh, really joyful. So we're grateful for it. Now we're kind of returning back to work and mm -hmm. um, trying to just figure out what it's going to look like now that we're back home and kind of what our normal routine, routine will be now. So yeah. Um, yeah, it's been really good, and um, we're excited to see what happens this next year. As many of you may have heard already, we are having a baby. Baby! Yeah, due date is April 18th, so we'll see what's in here. <laughs> I don't know. God knows. Yeah. So, yeah. I think it's a human. <laughs> it's a puppy! <laughs> oh, no, it's not. <laughs> 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 uh, a girl puppy! <laughs> I know that I'm having a real human child, obviously. <laughs> um, so yeah, we're excited about that. And mm -hmm. uh, that's definitely been a highlight to returning home as well as just sharing that with all of our friends and family. So. Yeah, totally. Uh, and I mean, really, that that's kind of the premise for our prayer request for this month is uh, we'd love for you guys to be praying for us as we kind of reestablish new rhythms new anchors in our life, things that like are, are the consistent day-to-day -day schedule, which this past month uh, has been interesting. I, I got some time to sit down with Dave, Dave Powers and, and Tom Walsh, who's a couple of leaders in Worship in the Word, and uh, they, the word that they used to describe everything, I kind of talked to them about what we've been going through and where we're kind of at at the moment. They were like, you just sound kind of swirly. And I was like, yeah, yeah, totally. So. Uh, that's okay. It's an alright season. Uh, it's just we're reestablishing new ground, you know. Um, and uh, we uh, luckily we have our community that we're able to come back to the Worship in the Word group, which we do house church with, and and then also the the Crux, which we we meet with and have a Bible study with. So like to have those consistencies. Uh, to now we're just moving into a rental property. 
uh, which is actually happening this weekend. And then Larissa just started her new job, or not, same job she had before. They just pulled her right back in the same position, everything like that. She's been doing training for that this week. So like we're, we're, we're making some groundwork, setting some groundwork for, you know, this next season. But we know that with the baby just around the corner with a few months away, it's just there's there's a lot of transition that's going on. And so if you could be covering us in prayer, we would totally appreciate that. Um, because, yeah, this is this is a beautiful season. Um, but it's just challenging whenever there's, there's less concrete things. So uh, we're spending a lot of time in the Word, hanging out with the Lord, and a lot of time with dearly loved brothers and sisters who help us stay grounded. Um, and that's, that's it, you know, that's our anchors. So, um, yeah, uh, we still have not planned a gathering, uh, to be able to tell you guys about our trip. Sorry about that. Uh, really the biggest thing is like, we've been so swirly that it's been like, when works, you know, we had family in town and then we had like all these other little complications. It was, it was really weird. So anyways, we almost had it actually, what would have been tonight. That's funny. Um, we almost planned it for tonight, but, um, yeah, we, we decided against it. So we'll make sure to put it out there and give people a couple weeks notice and everything like that and, and create a Facebook event and invite people. So if you want to be invited to that, feel free to hit us up with a message just in case you're like, I don't know if I would be. Most, most of the, In most cases, it's a lot of friends and family. So anyways, uh, that's the deal with the gathering. Um, and that's pretty much all we have for this month. Uh, totally love you guys. Totally appreciate all your love and support. And um, yeah, we will catch you guys next month with hopefully even more deets and update mischief. So mm -hmm. love you. Bye. Peace. See ya.